Hey everybody, it's Christina from Creations with Christina. I have an open box video to share with you today. You know, I went in just to order one or two things and I ended up ordering a couple of things, but that's okay. I wanted to stock up on some paper and stuff like that. So anyway, what first thing I wanted to share with you is Designer Series Paper. This is from the current um, annual catalog, Everyday Enchantment. This one, for some reason, does not list the colors um, on the information sheet that comes with the papers. Uh, I'll have to look online to see if it's on there. But anyway, I already flipped the colors. It comes with two sheets of each pattern. So I already flipped them over so you can see it in the front and the back without me having to keep flipping everything back and forth. So I really love the patterns. This has a real nice vintage look to it. Like I said, I don't know the colors in this collection, so but I really love this pattern right here. Very pretty. I love this. I don't know. This reminds me of something, but I just, I don't know what it is it reminds me of. I'll have to, I'll have to think about that and figure it out. So I love this pattern, and this is the Damascus on the back side. This is a very pretty pattern. Love the floral print. The next one is Gingham Garden, and Gingham Garden goes with Night of Navy, Island Indigo, Melon Mambo, Daffodil Delight, Pear Pizzazz, and Whisper White. Again, I have these set up for front and back. So I love this color right here, this uh, striped color, and then they have a floral print. We have a green and this little scallop with the flowers in the center. We have a nice scallop color here. And that's the back side. I really love this color. That's a really nice, I love that shade of pear pizzazz, very pretty. Reminds me of a picnic blanket. And I think this is the last pattern in this set. We have these two. I like this floral print. Very pretty. This next one is Soho Subway. Let me find the information sheet on this one. Soho Subway it has crisp cantaloupe, early espresso, island indigo, summer star fruit, and very vanilla. Love this one. Very kind of grungy looking. And that's the back side. I have this pattern, and that's the front. I think this would make a great boy if you have boys or you make masculine cards or anything like that. I think this would be a great collection for that. Love this wood grain background with the painted look to it. A little New York City there. Fingers aren't working. We have newsprint, and that's the back side. And then this one right here is a grid with the numbers on it, and then on the front it has a whole bunch of New York kind of themed things, with a, which I think I'm going to be using for our trip to New York that we took um, last summer. This next one is Afternoon Picnic. It has basic gray, crushed curry, coastal cabana, pear pizzazz, soft suede, very vanilla, and wisteria wonder. It's got a lot of colors. So again, this is set up for front and back. So we have this pattern here, and then we have another newsprint in there. Love this shade, Wisteria Wonder. I've really started, just started playing with, and I really like it. Okay. This reminds me of a wallpaper. I got the crushed curry. And I love these kind of quilted patterns. So we have this one, and that's the back side. We have, I love this one too, it has like the hexagon, and that's the back to that one. I think the back to this one and the polka dots would look really nice together. And this one has the kind of chevron quilt look, and that's the back side. And then I think we're on to our next collection. Or am I still doing? Yeah, this is the next. So this next one is Eastern Elegance. Coastal Cabana, Crushed Curry, Smoky Slate, and Whisper White are the colors. So we have our front and backs again. I 
I really like the Smoky Slate. That's a really nice shade of gray. It's the Crushed Curry and the Coastal Cabana. So again, that's the front and back. It's got a lace, kind of lace scallop look. Again, front and the back. I think that's nice together. And then this is the front and the back of the last pattern. And then I'll show you all the other things that I purchased. So that was just the, the paper. I have some other things here. I just have a couple things. I'm gonna set those off to the side. I'll show you those later. I have the whisk, two packages of Whisper White because I go through this like crazy. I have one package of Very Vanilla. I got the Stamp and Pierce mat. I have, this is the larger one. This measures nine and a half by six and a half compared to my original one, which is just this little tiny square. So it was good to, to get that. So I got that. I got some other stamp sets. The Crazy Mixed Up Love, which I think is absolutely adorable. I love the blender, it will blend well. And there's the lava lamp, so I lava you. Be mine, so cute. The Tape It, which kind of has like a washi tape kind of look to it, so I got that one. I got Bug Me, where you could build your own butterflies and ladybugs, so cute. And then Baby We've Grown, which is from the, um, <laughs> Occasions catalog and I really like the owls and the bunny rabbit I thought would be, make a great for Easter so I got those and then I also got this papillion I think it's papillion potpourri I hope I'm saying that right but it's these butterflies right here and they're so cute so I got the coordinating uh, punches for that I got the small butterfly and the larger butterfly and then for some yarn and thread I've, or not yarn, ribbon and thread. I got the Calypso Coral Baker's Twine. And then I got three ribbons. I got, this is Bermuda Bay and Mella Mambo in the 1 8 inch taffeta ribbon. And this is the taffeta white ribbon in, this is I think 3 eighths of an inch. Yeah, 3 eighths of an inch. Because the only, I don't really have any white ribbon. Um, I picked up the blender pens because next week you'll see a video I'm going to be using um, one stamp set and a set of these blender pens is in one of the videos and mine was totally dried up. It worked long enough for the video but after that I couldn't do anything more. So I bought a package of those. I also got the, uh, what collection is this? The Subtles refills. So I bought these. So I want to play around with maybe some techniques using the refills. Then for my freebies, because it was also during celebration, I got a couple of things. I really love the yarn in here. So this is the Sweet Sorbet accessory pack and I loved the yarn in here, so I got that. And then my ba Banner Blast set that I purchased or picked up for celebration was Wood Mount and I could have sworn I had purchased uh, the clear, but I, I did accidentally type in the Wood Mount um, number. But anyway, this is the clear, so I got myself that one. And then I got the Bitty Punch. This is the Bitty Banner, I think it's called. No, it's just called Banner. And then the Banner Blast stamp set, which I already have now, so I am going to actually give this away. So head over to my blog where you can enter to win this stamp set and punch. And then I also got the Decorative Dots, which I'm also including in the giveaway. So you're going to get Decorative Dots, the Banner Blast, and the coordinating punch to banner blast. So head over to my blog so you can enter to win that. And then the last thing I got, and I don't think I could put this into the camera, is I picked up the ink caddy that um, I'm gonna put here on my desk and I will do a video with a review and how to put it together and stuff like that in my next video. So if you have any questions, let me know. Um, I'll link all of the things I purchased down below so that if you wanna check them out, you can. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to give a nice big thumbs up and click the little subscribe button for more videos. Here are a few videos that are available in my YouTube library. All you have to do is click the photos or visit the links down below in the YouTube description. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.